everyone, this is Carol. Today I will show you how to make a video of this folding city or mirror dimension effect. The process is very simple and it can be done in just one minute. If you are interested in this video, keep watching. To create this effect, we just need to prepare a piece of aerial footage of the building. It is better to have this kind of footage clip flying over the roof of the building. In addition, the appropriate music and sound effects can also help to create a sense of atmosphere. After getting the material ready, let's start making the video. Let's open VideoPort Vlogger. Click here to create a new sequence. Then, import the video, music, and sound effects into VideoPort Vlogger. We drag and drop the video clip to the timeline. Then, click here to move the video down and move it approximately halfway. Then, we make a copy of the clip. Put a copied clip on the overlay track. Then find the flip in inspector. Select a vertical flip. Next, click here again. Move the clip from the overlay track to the top half of the screen. Let's play and see the effect. Well, now there is a sensation, but I feel that the middle of the screen is a little bit empty. And the top and bottom of the picture are too symmetrical, which looks a little bit uniform. We can try to add some details. Again, drag the video onto the timeline track. Click on Crop. Let's come to the top of the building. Then crop the upper blank area a little bit. Click on Apply. Then click here. In the preview window, we move the video to almost this position, a bit closer to the top than before. Then copy it and put it on the overlay track as before. Give it a vertical flip and adjust the position a little bit and align it as well. Let's play it. Well, it looks more natural now. We can export the video. And then, import the video back. Put the video on the video track. Since I'm using 4K footage and 4K sequence here, it is easy to zoom in a little bit without blurring the image. Here, we can use motion to create a rotation and shrinking effect like this to enhance the performance of the image. Click here to open the motion. Click here to add a first keyframe. Let's scale down the frame. Then, rotate it a little bit to about 30 degrees. And then, add another keyframe at about this position. Restore the window. And change the speed mode to smooth speed down 1. Let's play it and see the effect. Well, it works pretty well. Finally, we import music and sound effects into the timeline. The effect is basically done. 
let's see the final result. Well, this is all for today's video. And if you want to know more about other and tricks or what has been going on with Vidipa Vlogger, be sure to click that subscribe button to the subscribe channel if you haven't yet. And we'll see you soon in our next video. Hope you enjoy. Bye bye.